denizens of this marvellous planet. Welcome along, we've put everything we can into position for two sensational hours of fun. <laughs> now we just need you to pop your ten penneth in. Uh, you do that, we're away. Uh, assuming things are ghosts when the explanation is actually much more straightforward. Or is it? Oh, maybe it's the thing you did when you were young, a youngster. I don't know. Oh, that'll be the ghost. Maybe somebody said it to you and you thought, oh no, no, I'll never sleep. Yeah. Also, who cares? Move them on. Clear them. <laughs> Top bird trumpingtons, of course. I want to know what's going on in your garden. Have you got a little bowl of water or, or, or ate out for them? So they can have a wash. Maybe they're just going dust as opposed to water. They are in my garden. They are in my garden, even. Um, coping on the allotment. Maybe you were mid-glut and they brought in the hosepipe ban and now you've just got to strip the place before, before your crops get parched. What are you doing with them? Uh, intel gathering, of course, keeping your eyes peeled on uh, all local events. I mean, they may or may not be any of your... Damned business, but that's not the point, is it? It's like, who's this now? Who's this? <laughs> I just want you to... Moments where you've caught yourself. That's what I'm after there. Just when you've caught yourself. What the hell's that? And it's nothing to do with you. <laughs> uh, windows open, of course, at the moment. So I'm wondering if you had any uh, four-legged visitors... <laughs> Anyone just popped in? Or maybe they were there waiting for you when you went up to bed. Inappropriate gifts, that's still got a few legs. Just that time where you cannot understand your wife's reaction when you bought her that hoover for her birthday. What the hell's the problem? I thought you wanted it. <laughs> oh, well, you know, things of that ilk. And landmarks that signal you're nearly there. Maybe it's arriving home. Maybe you're on your way to your nan and granddad's or a, fame, a, a fave holiday spot. But there, there's the tree! Oh, there's the... Whatever it happens to be, let us know. Uh, skating tonight. Uh, we're wondering whether it's just going to be swimwear with comedy inflatables. We just don't know. We can't make our mind up. But uh, we'll leave that to you because it's going to be fabulous on the ice tonight. I th I'm expecting a full house. And um, I want to know about things that you buy that have got an added bonus. Like, I love a bunch of asparagus. And the thing that might actually steer me over, you know when you think, mm, am I going to cook them tonight or shall I just leave it? Those sturdy rubber bands are good for all manner of things. I've had three bunches of asparagus in the last 10 days, which, trust me, is a lot for me. <laughs> There's only so much salad you can eat when you're not well. <laughs> However, it wasn't COVID. Stop saying it was. It wasn't. It was just a lurky old bug. So, uh, yeah, bonus things to, to one purchase you make. It's got a little bit of a bonus. Uh, crow drops, of course. Um, things that birds drop. So it doesn't have to be crows. It might be another another branch of bird entirely. However, you know, I like things dropping out of nowhere. It feels a bit biblical. And tenuous links to a famous, or indeed to top BBC earner, Alan the Shearer. Any of those sort of links, very... <gasps> Camping carrot and mohos. What's the area like? Has it been worth the journey? Have you settled? Do we need to know a few little bits and pieces? Do you like your neighbours? Come on, spill it. And uh, are we finished with anagrams? I don't know. I think there might be a bit of leg left in that, but we'll leave that to you. So as per, what in the name of Angela Ritten, Ritten's many talents? Watched her the other day. She's amazing. Angela, and reduced to rip off Britain. It's, it's not good enough for Ripon. I want more for her. What are you having for tea? That's really what I, I had to mention her about. 88291, lisa.t at bbc.co.uk. Hashtag Lisa Tarbuck Radio. So uh, nothing taxing for our second track in tonight. Just an absolute classic. <laughs> 